Hello, I'm Alex Zane, and welcome to RudeTube. Now, tonight's show, well, we've got a flag-waving celebration for you of the heroes and villains immortalised on the web. Here, tonight, are those special clips that showcase the epic dramas of life. Good versus bad, man versus sofa, monkey versus car. In short, the stuff of legend. <laughs> And with that, we have reached our number one, and our hero of heroes is... Marina Orlova! No? Right, well, she left her native Russia with nothing, but has gone on to save the English language, armed only with her trusty webcam, her quest for knowledge, and a clear disdain for clothes. It took Marina's lessons on the origin of words two years to get her noticed, and she hasn't looked back. Hello, my dear students. Your teacher, Hat for Words, is back with another lesson. The word pencil comes to English in 1386 from the old French pincel, which means an artist, paintbrush. And that comes from the Latin peninsulas, which literally means little tail, which is a diminutive of penis, which means tail in Latin. I had no idea what to do. I mean, I had no job. Like, I need to do something. So my friend showed me YouTube. And he was like, do something there. So pencil, through a chain of derivations, comes from the Latin word penis, which is where we get the word penis from as well. Her YouTube channel is more popular than the BBC's and she's the most watched guru on the internet. I'm very happy that I have a big audience. If they learn something from me, that's, you know, that's the results of my show. I love it, you know, it's, it means I succeeded. Yes. Marina is one of the most popular women in the history of the online viral, and she knows it. I should be number one, right? You're the teacher's pet today. Luckily for her, she was right. I am? Nice! Yeah! Corby, Corby, come here. We're number one. That's so cute. Thank you so much. So there we have it. The most popular internet hero or villain, depending on your sensibilities, is a Russian with a thesaurus. 